In this series of video tutorials, we will learn how to implement SOAP Web Services with Spring Web Services. We will also learn how to use a free third-party tool, SOAP UI, to test our SOAP Web Service. SOAP is a protocol designed to exchange information. It is primarily based on XML documents over HTTP, but email and JMS can also be used. SOAP Web Services are based on a web service description language, also known as a whistle, which is an XML contract that defines all the data and services offered by a given web service. The client and the server both use this contract as a basis for exchanging information and making remote procedural calls. Included in the slide is the link to the w3.org SOAP specification. Spring Web Services is a product of the Spring community for SOAP Web Services. Spring Web Services aims to facilitate contract-first SOAP service development. The product is based on Spring itself. People often use Spring Web Services after finding alternative SOAP web stacks lacking. Spring Web Services also conforms to the best practice of contract-first development and having a loose coupling between contract and implementation. This series of video tutorials is an introduction on how to get going with SOAP Web Services. For a detailed deep dive, you can refer to the original Spring reference documentation provided on the links in this slide. Now here is what we will learn. First we will take a look at the SOAP prerequisite concepts of XML, XSD and Whistle. Then we will create a SOAP endpoint with Spring Web Services with the help of IntelliJ and the Maven archetype. And then finally, we will install a SOAP client test tool, SOAP UI, which we will use to test our working Spring Web Services SOAP endpoint. And that concludes our introduction. In the next tutorial, we will go over our sample business problem.